As Jim Rohn once said, financial independence is the ability to live from the income of your personal resources. Words of wisdom indeed. But what does this mean in practical terms? It's about cultivating money habits that lead to wealth creation. Financial independence isn't about being rich overnight, it's about creating a sustainable income that doesn't rely on your day-to-day -day work. This is where effective money habits come into play. Now, who was Jim Rohn, you might ask? A successful entrepreneur, author and motivational speaker, Rohn has left a significant mark on the field of personal development and finance. His insight into wealth creation and personal growth has inspired millions around the world to take control of their finances. Understanding and mastering money habits, as Rohn has emphasized, is a crucial step towards achieving financial independence. Remember, the journey to financial independence begins with understanding and mastering your money habits. One of the most crucial money habits to develop is saving. It's not about how much you earn, but how much you save. So, let's delve into the importance of saving. Picture this, you're putting aside a small portion of your income every month. It may seem insignificant at first, but over time these small savings can accumulate into a substantial nest egg. Why is that? It's all thanks to the power of compound interest, a financial wizardry that makes your savings grow exponentially over time. Think of it as your money working for you, even when you're not. Now how to save effectively? The key is consistency. Consider setting aside a certain percentage of your income every month. It doesn't have to be a significant amount. Remember it's not about the amount you save, but the habit of saving consistently that makes all the difference. With consistent saving, your wealth will grow over time, bringing you one step closer to financial independence. While saving is important, it's not enough on its own. To truly grow your wealth, you need to invest. Think of investing as planting a seed. It may take time for that seed to grow into a tree, but once it does, it'll bear fruit year after year. This is exactly what investing does to your money. It helps it grow, sometimes slowly, sometimes rapidly, but always surely. Investing can take many forms. Stocks, bonds, and real estate are just a few examples. Each comes with its own set of risks and rewards. Stocks, for instance, can offer high returns but can also be volatile. Bonds, on the other hand, are generally more stable but offer lower returns. Real estate investment can provide a steady income stream but it requires a significant upfront investment. Remember, investing is not about getting rich quick, it's about growing your wealth steadily and surely over time. By investing wisely, you can multiply your savings and accelerate your journey to financial independence. Now that you understand the importance of saving and investing, it's time to take action. Embarking on your financial journey begins with setting a savings goal. Aim for your first $10,000. It might sound daunting but remember, every millionaire started with their first dollar. Next, craft a budget. Understand your income and expenses. This will help you identify where you can cut back and save more. As Jim Rohn once said, either you run the day, or the day runs you. Don't let your expenses run your life. Now it's time to start investing. Don't be intimidated, you can start small. There are countless resources available to help you make informed decisions. Lastly, monitor your financial plan regularly. Adjust it as needed. Your journey to $10,000 won't be a straight line but with persistence and discipline, you'll get there. By following these steps you are well on your way to achieving your first $10,000 and ultimately, financial independence.